Local Democrats fire back tonight, saying the president acted recklessly by hosting a rally in Omaha. As coronavirus cases rise in Nebraska, Democrats feel the president should focus on controlling the pandemic. KTV News Watch 7 Sarah Feely continues our Commitment 2020 team coverage. Democrats push back against the president's visit to Omaha. Donald Trump will be here today for essentially a super spreader rally. And we have seen all across the country when he holds these rallies that you see a spike in cases. Nebraska Democratic Party Chair Jane Klebb says Trump promised a health care plan, but says he has nothing to show for it. She calls out the president for risking the lives of Nebraskans with the rally. Now this, after cases are already spiking, it's reckless and it's irresponsible. Pottawatomie County Democrat Dr. Glenn Hurst criticized the president's pandemic response, saying he, quote, botched it. When he hears masks, wear your mask, what he hears is that's weakness. And what you and I hear is that service, that selflessness. Democrat Kara Eastman in a closely watched race against Don Bacon calls the rally unsafe. It just looks as if they are not taking this fight seriously and that they've abandoned fighting this pandemic. She says Nebraskans are ready for a change in Washington that's willing to fight for people, not just votes. Instead of focusing on COVID relief to individuals and small businesses and our public health infrastructure, they're choosing to risk even more lives in our district, and I believe that this shows that we need real change. She hopes people will take their frustrations to the polls. For some people who voted for Trump thinking they would see something different in Washington, D.C., that the swamp would be trained, um, I think they feel let down. In Omaha, Sarah Feely, KETV, News Watch 7.